Good Thursday afternoon, Channel 11 Live Weather Impact Meteorologist Melissa Noor. Another great day feeling outside where it feels cooler and breezy to kick off your Thursday. A little bit of cloud cover still evident in the background there, but it's only 79 here in Atlanta currently. And as we head through the afternoon, we will not get into the 90s. We'll be stuck in the 80s again. A lot of areas still in the 70s right now. You can see on the temperature map, Gainesville 77, Clayton just 72 up in Raven County, 79 in uh, Covington and Peachtree City 78. And this is what's been happening over the course of the day today. We've had some of the cloud cover thinning out now building back in again. But if you look west of us in Alabama, that's where we're seeing some showers beginning to develop. But those showers not going to have the opportunity to return to our area because of this a little east wind that's coming in here, and that'll help to reinforce the drier air in place. So on the outskirts of that east wind is where we see the showers and storms developing for us here, though, in North Georgia. It's going to stay comfortable outside over the next couple of days. Let's talk about the hour by hour forecast here, and you can see that as we go through the afternoon, partly cloudy, mostly sunny at times, and we're going to stay dry here out to our west in Alabama. There will be some isolated showers, but the temperatures today are incredibly comfortable outside. This will be um, a number of days in a row now that we have not made it up to 90. Nice little change out there. Forecast track this evening, cooling back into the 70s. Looks great for Truist Park this evening for the game, uh, last game against the Phillies in the series. And then tomorrow morning, another comfortable, cool, crisp start in the mid 60s. Outlying suburbs, low 60s. And with that east breeze sticking around again tomorrow, we'll keep the temperatures below average in the mid 80s. Another day with a lot of sunshine in store for us. Now, gradually, there will be some changes coming in by the tail end of the weekend. More heat, more humidity returning eventually, and that's going to send our temperatures back up into those full summer like feelings outside as we get into the middle of next week. But for today, 86 will be the high temperature here in Atlanta. We average 89 this time of year. We were in the mid 80s yesterday and the day before that and the day before that. So today we'll make day number four, not in the 90s. A nice little change out there. 79 for Clayton and 84 in Peachtree City. Now, this is not true fall weather. Even though the mornings have been cool and comfortable and crisp, we are expecting a change in the temperature pattern. And this map shows you what I'm about to talk you through is how we're going to get a lot hotter into next week. Notice the colors through the start of the weekend, those cooler colors, the greens, the yellows, but two to our west, I'm tracking another heat dome, which is going to be building here over the southern plains into Texas. They've got a lot of heat advisories, excessive heat warnings in effect, but focus in on where that pink is on the map. As we go through the weekend into early next week, we start to see that heat. The pink colors expanding eastward, and that designates our temperatures going up. It shows our temperatures getting hotter and hotter as we make our way into the middle of next week. So although things are feeling great outside right now, comfortable morning lows, warm but not really hot and sticky afternoons, things are going to be changing as we work our way through the next week. High temperatures day by day, 86 today, 87 tomorrow. We'll start the weekend with highs just below 90, but as we get into Sunday, that heat dome really starts to inch its way into our area. So 90 will kickstart our next heat wave across North Georgia, and this one looks like we could have some temperatures that are going to be even in some spots into the upper 90s by the latter half of next week. So a lot of heat coming. The humidity will climb as well. We're watching out for weather impacts from heat related illnesses as we get into the mid to latter half of next week. But in the meantime, today things are really nice outside, partly cloudy, little breeze coming in again today, and we'll keep those temperatures topping out in the mid 80s for highs. And once we see the sun setting this evening with the dry air in place, we'll clear that cloud cover out. Looks really comfortable. We've got a 708 first pitch this evening. Notice temperatures between 8 and 10 o'clock dropping down through the 70s, and then by midnight tonight, we are seeing some air areas already in the 60s. Tomorrow morning we'll wake up 60s everywhere, even some 50s up in the North Georgia mountains. And then tomorrow another really pleasant day looks great for high school football games as well. A stark contrast from last Friday when a lot of those games were rained out. A little bit hotter over the weekend also looks great for the Falcons. They got that preseason game at home at the Benz Friday evening. As we go into the weekend, though, things are going to be turning hotter. 91 by Sunday. Look at next Wednesday, 97 degrees, a lot of heat to come. We'll be back with a news and weather update coming up in 25 minutes. We'll see you then.